Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today we are playing on a map called... Towers! And this is a map that was built by Builders Unit. Uh, you can see some of the uh, the individual and uh, the main builders uh, that helped build this map. And a lot of them uh, are actually in the game with me today. You can see I'm here being joined by Arbold, uh, MC Climax, uh, Ubiquitous1, I think I said that right, uh, Reaper0, uh, Big V Stats, Elfly X, and Ballistic Squid. So a lot of uh, uh, friendly faces joining me in this game. And it's a bit of a unique PvP game. I'm not going to go and try and explain it all now because it will probably sound ridiculously confusing. But trust me, uh, it's not. Uh, when we get into the game, we're going to understand it. Basically, the aim of the game is to destroy each other's towers and the way you do that is by pressing some buttons to move some uh, pistons up and uh, then once that gets to the top it blows up their tower and yeah the the last person in the game wins and while this is all going on uh, we're all going to be attacking each other and trying to like save our towers and all sorts of stuff as well uh, but before that uh, we're going to uh, decide which color team we're on so everyone's going to come up one by one and uh, press this button and then they're going to get a different colored piece of wool uh, so if I send up our bold first if I do um, he can use buttons and switches uh, he should come up and press it and he's going to get either a different colored piece of wool or a creeper's head and uh, then once he's um, uh, once he's got that, uh, yeah, we're going to see who gets to do like a bonus mini game. Uh, sorry, I'm making this sound really confusing, aren't I? Basically, uh, one person's going to get a creeper head that's going to come out. And if you get the creeper head, that means you uh, got a little mini game to try and shoot these balloons. Uh, we can get some some bonus stuff. And no one's coming up. It's supposed to be once I give them permissions, they come up. Let me just keep doing this until someone actually decides to to come up and uh, press the button. Uh, there we go. Someone's actually been checking uh, their permissions. There we go. So uh, Ubiquitous is on the, the orange team. So uh, he didn't get the, the creeper head. Uh, but we now know that he is orange, which is sad. It means I'm not going to be orange. Uh, so let me see if uh, Reaper Zero wants to go up. If I give him permissions, he should come up and press a button. Uh, so we can go and see which team he's going to be on. Uh, he's coming up and he's going to be on the green team. And uh, next coming up, we got uh, Big B Stats. Uh, let's give him some permissions. There's a, an Iron Golem who I think wants to wants to join in on the fun. And uh, Big B Stats is going to be the red team. This is good because I'm going to go last. And uh, this means that the... Um, uh, that that the the creeper head is still in there, which gives me a chance to get uh, all of the uh, all of the bonus loot. Right, Elfa Lee's coming up, and Elfa Lee got the he got the yellow team, which is good. Which means the um the creeper head is still in there. And then the last person to give permissions to uh, is Ballistic Squid, and uh, he's coming up to see what team he's gonna be. He's gonna be the the blue team, yeah. Which means the creeper head is still in there. Right here comes Climax, and Climax. <gasps> he's gonna be purple. Is that everyone? Has everyone gone up? I'm not sure. Has has Arbold gone up yet? I'm not, I can't remember him doing one. Uh, maybe he did, but I didn't notice. Anyway, let me go and have a go. Then am I gonna get the creeper head? No, I'm on the I'm on the blue team. I'm on the blue team, which I think means that Arbold uh, has got to be the um. He's got to be the the, the creeper head. Oh no! I was a 50-50 chance, and I wasn't able to win. <laughs> right, well done, Arbold which means if we go behind here uh, there's uh, a bow and a load of arrows and he's got eight shots uh, in order to to try and uh, hit the balloon so let me just go throw them down for him there and uh, let me go and uh, give him some permission so that uh, he's able to to shoot and so there's going to be all these big balloons up here and he needs to shoot them uh, to try and blow them up and whichever color uh, he's able to blow up uh, he's going to get a little bonus bit of blue and did he hit that i think he might have hit one then oh no he didn't hit it. i think it was very close though i think he's going for the the pale blue one over there he's getting really close only he's getting closer to it up there he's decided to get a little bit closer he's not hit any yet and so basically he'll get a prize from this and oh, i think he hit it did he manage to hit it I, I think the i think the light went up yeah there we go he managed to hit the blue one you can see it there blew up and so he's going to get a prize which he's going to be able to use in the game so it'll be like a piece of armor or like a potion or a weapon or uh, some sort of thing like that and he's managed to get one i think he's only got uh, one or two more shots left but uh, yeah it's not too bad and another thing he also gets to, to keep the bow as well which is pretty handy so there we go he managed to get the the pale blue prize and so whatever is in this chest, I'm not going to have a peek. I'm going to leave it up to him. Uh, yeah, he's got some, some probably some, some bonus armor or some sort uh, of other goodie. So jolly good. And before we start the, the actual game proper, uh, we need to go inside of this room here. And uh, here's just uh, all of the, the rules of the game. But I've pretty much said them all to you anyway. Uh, we drop down into that room there. Look how amazing this is, by the way. And this is called the treasure room. And basically, we got one minute to run around and grab as much treasure as we can. But before we do that, I'm going to have to go and uh, give everybody their permissions to uh, open containers. As uh, so if I go and give that to everyone, then I'm going to open the little trap door. Then we all drop down and we have one minute uh, in order to try 
try and get as much loot as we can before we go into our towers. Everyone's there getting ready, edging. As soon as I open this, they're all going to dive down like crazy. Right, guys? Go, 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 go! Let me just go and start my timer. My minute timer has started. I can't get down, though. We're all fighting to fit through. <laughs> right, here we go. Let's go, 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 go. So I'm on the blue team, but uh, for here it doesn't really matter. I need to try and steal as much stuff as we can. Oh, look, I've got a bunch of iron ingots here. I can make uh, an iron sword with that. I can see a chest down in the corner over here. i got three iron ingots. I can at least make a sword. Oh, look, I can get this whole chest by myself. Well, you're not going to steal that potion. Me and Big B stats are fighting over all of this loot. I think he gave up. I think he realized I was pretty quick with my fingers and he decided to run away. There's another chest hidden down here. Oh, diamonds. Three diamonds I managed to get from there. And I got all these bottles of enchanting. So if I give uh, myself loads of stuff, I can get a, um, yeah, if I give myself loads of XP, I can give myself like an enchanted sword or something. Do you reckon this one's looted already? Yep, that one's already taken. Uh, there's one behind here, probably. Yeah, oh, look, more diamonds. Diamonds, diamonds, diamonds. Once again, me and Big B stats fighting over stuff. I oh, know, I think I, I think I put all of my gold ingots into the chest and he just stole them or what a fail. <laughs> anyway, there seems to be like a, a bit of parkour going up here. There might be some more chests that I can get round here. Oh look, there's another chest. Oh no, that's time. That is time up. You can hear my little bell ringing off. <laughs> right, we need to we need to go into our, our towers then. Where, where's my tower? My tower over here is the uh, the dark blue one. So I need to go in there. You can hear those, those bells going off quietly in the background. So now I've gone into my tower. It should block it off uh, so no one else is able to get in. And then I should go and hop down here. And uh, this is my little spawn room. So this is the top of my tower. And um, once uh, this is blown up, it's going to destroy my bed. And uh, then I'm not going to be able to, um, yeah, I'm not going to be able to, to carry on the game. So I'm just waiting for a few more people to go and drop down. Uh, hopefully they've all been timing as well. And uh, look at all this stuff in here. What I might do is I might just put all of this loot in for now. And while I'm waiting for everyone to get ready, uh, I suppose I might as well give myself a sword and stuff. Actually, I don't know if I'm allowed to do that yet. Uh, I won't bother with that for now then because we all need to go to bed. So uh, the last thing I need to do is once again, just go and give everyone all of their permissions. And then, yeah, when we sleep in the morning, we can go and... And uh, start the game properly. So uh, is, every, is everyone in their pods? Hopefully they are. If I need to just give Squids his final uh, permissions. And do we all seem to be set? Everyone seems to be set and getting ready to bed. So I'm just going to grab uh, any old sword from here now. And uh, go and grab some, some chainmail armor. And uh, I get a bow and arrow as well. Just so I'm ready to immediately go and dive down. And uh, start doing some, some fighting. So let's go to bed. And then the second it's morning. The game is going to begin. How awesome is Star Wars that? That's such a cool way to start a game. All these little mini games games and little the treasure run and stuff it's such a fun thing to do before we even get into into the game properly and here we go we've started so i don't actually know where i go i think i just dropped down here uh, yeah i think if i go straight down here and i know i've got all my levels and diamonds upstairs but if i just go and grab all of this stuff from here now there we go i've got loads of uh, potions of harming uh, so if someone goes after me i can just splash them immediately and uh, what you need to do and so you go and press these buttons. So see if I press that, you can see it gets extended up and I'm moving that piece of white wool up. Oh, someone's going after me already. Right, let's use all of these potions, shall we? Let's go and knock Lee back. I think he's hurt. I can see him there running away from me. Right, let's just go and charge him down. Let's go try and take him out and then I can go straight after his tower. I think he had a potion of something. I, had a, I think he had like a, a potion of healing or something. Oh, he's going after mine now. You leave me alone, Lee. <laughs> right, if I try and get a, a last like shot arrow at him. There we go. I got a good hit on him there. That's, that's, that's backed him off a little bit. And right, let's go and try carrying on pushing his up a little bit then shall we i need to move that one up and then that one up there we go i'm moving up a little bit more it's going to be so scary when i die though so i'm not going to be able to see anyone oh no i pressed the wrong button i need to move that one and then move that one i think there we go that's moving up i can see lee there going back for mine let's try let's go after him then shall we let's go after him oh no he's got me really weak he's got me really weak here we are on peaceful so my health should go up quite quickly and i think he does have a, a healing potion as well <laughs> i haven't even seen what everyone else is doing some people have got their towers quite high already actually i know no, that's me taken out. Right, I need to be very quick and I need to try and get some some more armor on so I can go and dive straight back down. Uh, once again, I'm not going to worry about getting all of the, the good loot. I'm just going to try and get straight down there just so I can go and start protecting my tower because I know Lee is going to be going for it. Uh, there, there we go. It's just saying that I was killed by Elf Lee. Right, there's no one by my tower. Uh, here's Lee uh, Bigby Stats trying to get someone else. Let's go after Bigby Stats. Oh no, he's got a diamond sword. I do not want to be fighting him. I've changed my mind. I'm sorry Bigby Stats. I'm sorry. Right, so I, I think what I'm going to do for now is just really try and protect my tower uh, just to make sure no one else can get it. So I'm going to try and uh, get some of this better stuff. If I make a diamond sword out of the, the stuff I got earlier. Right, where did I put all my diamonds? Was it in this one? I know they're just bottles of water. Oh, where did I put all my diamonds? Was it in one of these chests? Uh, do I have some diamonds? There we go. I got six diamonds here and some sticks. And uh, if I get some uh, bottles of enchantment, 
If I go and uh, splash all of these all over the place, and then if I enchant a, uh, a diamond sword, uh, even though I'm wasting a bit of time doing this now, I should hopefully uh, be almost invincible when everyone goes after me. So uh, if I make a... Where's, where's a crafting table here? Oh no, I think I'm wasting too much time doing this. I'm scared someone's going to destroy my tower. Right, quick, diamond sword, diamond sword, diamond sword. I need to just go and enchant it if I can. Let me just go and shove that in there. Uh, oh, I haven't got many levels at all, really. Okay, this will do. Let's go get that. I've got sharpness. Let's put my diamonds back in there. And let's go down as quick as I can. Oh no, I think there's someone right by my tower. Uh, I then want to get a bow and arrow. Or should I get some armor? This will do. Then I'm just going to go and jump straight back down there and try and kill whoever's going after my tower. All right, let's go, 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 go. Oh look, there's someone right here. They're getting it up loads. Oh no, they're doing loads of damage against me. Who's that? That's Lee. Of course it's Lee going back after me. Right, here we go. I've got to be able to get him now. There we go. That's what you get for trying to get my tower. Oh no, I don't want Climax to get me though because I got a diamond sword. Run. Let's just run. Is he going to chase me? Is he going to keep chasing me? Yep, he is. <laughs> the good thing about it being peaceful though is I can just run away for a bit and then once my health's up a bit more I can just turn around and hopefully uh, be able to take him out. There's people running all over the place around here. Let's just keep running as long as I keep my thing defended. Right, let's turn around and let's take out Climax then. You're trying to chase me, are you? You're trying to chase me? Oh no, he got me! He actually did manage to, to take me out. Right, let's jump back up here and let's go and try and make myself a um another diamond sword then. I think I had uh, enough spare diamonds to make another one. Where did I put them though? Uh, not in there. There we go. There's my diamonds here. And uh, let's go grab a potion of healing while we're here. And oh, I need sticks as well, actually. Do I have any more sticks on me? Yeah, right. If I go and get myself a couple sticks and I'm going to put uh, two more diamonds left so I can make another one. And once again, I'm being so slow. It's because I'm panicking. It's because I'm panicking. I'm doing this all really slowly. Right, diamond sword. And I got a potion of healing. I got one more spare diamond on me. Let's go put my armor on. And let's go grab a bow and arrow if I got time. I can see Lee there on his side, directly opposite me. Hi, Lee. Right, let's go down then, shall we? Is anyone here? Okay, no one seems to be going after my tower right now. And oh no, I just fell straight down. Oh, I need to go get all my stuff again. I just fell down and left all my stuff down here. Right, go, 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 go. I need to go grab all this stuff again. Oh no, I'm going to be getting hit. I'm going to be getting hit. I've got no armor on or anything. I think someone stole all of my stuff. Right, I managed to put a chest plate on at least. And look, I've got 28 um, ingots from someone here and uh, a whole load of levels. Oh, look, there's a guy right here. I don't think he's got his weapon out. He's got a diamond sword though. Oh no, he managed to get me. I think that's the diamond sword that I had just made. Right, I should have enough, I think, to make one more. Uh, I think I should have two more diamonds left, which is what I need to make uh, another diamond sword. Oh no, I think I, I took too many down earlier. Oh, this is not this is not good. I don't know, I don't have any time to make any potions. I'm not going to start brewing. Right, let's just go grab my boring old iron sword again and go get a bow and arrow. And let's go down and just try and keep my my tower safe. When your tower's destroyed, that isn't you immediately out. Uh, you still got more time. It's basically once your tower's destroyed and then uh, you're killed again, then it's taken out. And Lee really is just going for me. Why are they just targeting me? <laughs> Climax and Lee have just been a massive pain. And look how much stuff everybody's got compared to me. Oh, this? I've got a potion of uh, harming on me here. I think there's like more stuff in some of these buildings here. Oh, I can't get in this side, apparently. Right, if someone comes after me, I've got my, my splash potion of uh, harming. I should probably go and try and take out some of other people. People's stuff. I think this is Lee's here, and seeing as Lee's bullying me, I want to try and get rid of um, I want to get rid of him. He seems to be pretty weak. There seems to be a lot of people chasing after him, I think. <laughs> I've got my splash potion of harming. Oh, look how much armor and stuff everyone's got. Everyone's so more kitted out. I kind of want them all just to, to take out each other's. I kind of just want to defend my place here, just because, um, yeah, it seems to have been hurt so much. I'm just scared that they're, they're all going to be able to, to go for me. Now, I don't know why I'm bothering giving myself some levels, seeing as I don't think there's any uh, enchanting tables down here anyway. And oh no, someone's got blown up. Someone's, is that their tower gone? Oh no, no, I just got destroyed immediately. Right, let's just try and grab this and get straight back down before someone goes after my tower. I'm pretty sure Lee's going to be charging there immediately, seeing as he <laughs> seems to have really taken a, a disliking to me this game for some reason. Right, let's go put my armor on and let's just go and try and defend. Oh yeah, look, there's a tower's gone. Whoever was orange team, their tower's gone down. Oh no, no, I died. I died as I fell down as I was trying to take that person out. I think they got knocked down as well, but uh, they can probably go and run straight back up. I need to be more careful as I drop down and I'm onto my last iron sword. And I'm running out of all of my, my chainmail armor here as well. Right, okay, I want to be very careful as I drop down here. I could kind of just stay here and just sort of shoot down. I think there's, there's Lee once again trying to get back up. Let's shoot him down. Let's go take out Lee, shall we? There we go. I managed to shoot him with my arrows from up here. He's not even got any armor or anything. He just runs straight to me and just charges just straight for my place to try and take me out. <laughs> I think Lee just has really something against me today for some reason. Right, is there any, any good loot that I managed to get there? Nothing that's really going to help me out. Uh, I got another splash potion of harm. 
farming and there's Arbol chasing me down and look at Lee going straight back to me once again. <laughs> right, hopefully I can get Arbol to, to fight one of them. Lots of people seem to be being very defensive and just sort of guarding their own places. Should we see if we can take out Climax? If I get rid of Climax, I might be able to get that diamond sword, but oh, I can, there's nothing I can do against him close up. If I try and shoot him with arrows, I can try and get him as he's running towards me and try and keep pushing him back if I can. I'm doing okay here. I'm getting lots of good shots on him. If I go and use my sword now, oh no, he managed to get me. And that's like all of my good loot gone. I do up here uh, have some more iron. If I get this iron, if I just go and make myself a full set of iron armor, and if I get some sticks as well, I can make a um uh, an iron sword as well, and then that should be my last good set of armor and stuff. So uh, I want to make sure I can get the sword before I make the armor, because I think that's more important. And uh, can I make anything else? Can I make some boots and some leggings? There we go. I now got full iron armor and an iron sword. This is probably going to be my last my last big push. I've done pretty bad this game. I will be honest. I feel bullied though. I always feel bull bullied when I'm doing these games. People always seem to be really targeting me for some reason. I suppose it's the same for everyone else. Right, is anyone on my tower? Oh, there's someone trying to go up. Let's go and push them down. Elfa Lee again! Why is Elfa Lee only attacking me? I think he's only ever gone for me in this game. And he's now going up against Climax over there. Uh, he's going to be backing off because he's weak. Let's kill Lee. Let's get rid of Lee then, shall we? Seen as he, he seems so intent on bullying me. Let me see if I can go uh, after him as well then and try and take him out. Right, I managed to, to scare him off. Climax is literally just standing at the bottom of his tower just completely guarding it. Let's Let's go and see if we can get him then, because he's got that diamond sword. I think it's one of the diamond swords that I made. I think that is just enabling him to win, and here comes Lee again. I kind of want to get Lee just because he's been bullying me the entire game. Alright, let's see if we can try and take out Climax. Oh, Squid was slain by someone. I think Climax is going in to try and attack me. Oh, he's trying to loot round. Right, let's run away. At least I managed to get him away from his tower. It might give a chance for someone else to, to go after him. And there we go. Lee's actually attacking someone else for once. I think Arbold's there trying to defend it. I think that might be his tower. Uh, but yeah, Bigby stats hit the, the ground too hard. And Climax could have so easily gone after my tower then, but he's so de like set on just defending here. There's just nothing I can do when he's got that diamond sword. Like, he's just way too powerful. I just need to try and hit him back with these arrows, but as soon as he gets in close, he just destroys me and I'm crouching. I need to run. Oh no, I got pushed behind here. Right, let's just keep running away. Running away. I think there's two people fighting each other over there. Lee's got literally nothing. He's running around there naked without even a weapon or any armor whatsoever. And look, there's a big fight going on over here. I think Climax might actually be really weak for once. This might be the chance to try and get rid of him. This might be the, the chance to, to finally take him out. He's been so dominant this entire game. I need to get him before his health goes back up. There we go. I think, I think everyone's chasing after him. Right, while they're all distracted... I'm going to go and try and get uh, Lee's uh, thing a little bit up here. You're supposed to swim up here and then you press these buttons to try and move it up. If I try and... Oh, I keep missing the button. Oh, no, he pushed me off. Oh, no, that's Climax. Run away. Oh, no, he's still got that diamond sword. People weren't able to take him out. <laughs> I need to find some more diamonds or something. I've not actually looked in many of the, the chests around here. I'm just assuming uh, that they've all managed to be uh, looted by now. There's someone else uh, climbing up on someone else's tower. When you see people attacking peop other people's towers, it's kind of best just to leave them uh, because it doesn't really affect you. It's actually kind of good if they destroy someone else's tower. It's a weird sort of game where you're all kind of against each other, but you can still kind of help each other at the same time. Anyway, let's go and try and move Lee up a little bit. I'm getting some good progress here. I'm managing to move this up quite a little bit. I then need to press that button, then that button, I think. Is no one on my tower? Right, my tower is clear. If I go and move that one up a little bit more, and then... Oh, no, that's wrong. Oh, no, I'm getting knocked off. I think that was Lee. I think Lee just about caught on to what I was doing here. Let's run away. Oh, no, I threw my sword on the floor. Luckily, uh, I've got a whole load of spares. Where was I hit from? I think I might have been shot by an arrow from somewhere from miles away. Okay, there's someone there charging after me, and they've got diamond armor. Lee is once again running around naked. He's got absolutely nothing on him. <laughs> He's been very aggressive, but never had any of the good armor or anything. Okay, I think that person might be going after Lee's tower. I just gotta be careful that so many people have so much more better armor than me. And here's Squid. I've hardly seen Squid at all this game. Let's see if we can take Squid out, shall we? He's there rushing to defend his tower. There we go. I got him. And look at all this loot. I don't know if there's uh, anything that I haven't got here before, but look at all this stuff. It's just littered everywhere. Lee should probably charge in now and try and steal all this stuff. Is there anything better than what I've got? No, it's all just uh, chainmail stuff. What I've got's better than this. There's someone over there with diamond armor. I do not want to uh, entangle with him. I want to stay away from him as much as I can. My tower seems to be safe in the distance over there. There's Squid running in. Trying to grab all of his stuff again. Uh, let's see if we can take him out. Is he actually going to charge me down? I think he's trying to tell me to team up with him. Oh no, he's trying to, he's trying to block the arrows as I fire them at him. Right, he's he's running away over that way. Let's see if we can uh, go and take Squid out, shall we? Then maybe get his tower. Oh, he's found some armor. He's managed to find some armor by running around and put it on sneakily behind there. He went behind the building to get changed so we didn't have to watch him as he was getting changed. Oh no, no, someone's going after mine. Someone's going after mine all the way over there. Who is that? Oh, that's not Lee. It's not Lee for once. Someone's trying to destroy my tower. I've got to hit them off. I've got to ignore everyone 
someone trying to hit me and I got knock that guy off. There we go. I managed to save my tower. That was a little bit dangerous there. Right, let's go and try and uh, push up Lee's a little bit more then, seeing as he has been the, uh, the one that's kept going for me. I need to do that one there. And then my tower is safe right now. I need to then do that one if I can. And then it will be that one. And then it will be that one. Oh god, look at this. Look at the speed. Look at the speed I'm managing to push this up now. I then need to move up that one. And no, oh, no, that's me pushed off. Right, run away. Run away. Oh, that, that was Lee. I think he just used his fist to punch me. <laughs> You've been bullying me all game, Lee. I'm going to bully you for a little bit. <laughs> right, here we go. Here we go. I might actually be able to destroy a tower. Even though I'm probably not going to win. Because uh, a lot of people seem to have a lot of better swords and stuff than me right now. Uh, I still got a chance to, to at least get a small victory and uh, try and destroy someone else's tower. And oh, look, Lee's going for mine. <laughs> He's like, right, if you get my tower, I'm going to go for yours. Right, I need to get him. Oh, no, it's so close to the top. My tower is so unbelievably close to the top. I need to, I need to keep chasing him away. <laughs> I need to keep a very good eye. I think there's only about two more button pressures, uh, presses, and then my, my tower is going to be destroyed. So I need to be very careful. But Lee's getting pretty close to the top. I managed to get some uh, some pretty good progress moving this up over here. Right, he's not going to... Oh, he's going, is he going back to my tower? He is. It's not going to happen, Lee. I'm watching you now. I'm keeping a close eye on you. I'm getting charged down now by Climax. I need to get away. If I get killed, it's going to be really dangerous because then uh, Lee's basically going to have a, a free pass in order to go and destroy my tower. And there's also people going around it. I oh, know there's Lee. There's Lee right up over there. I need to go and try and shoot him off. Has he done it? Has he blown up my tower? I don't think he has. I need to kill this person. Lee is just so determined the entire game. I think his only goal was to try and get rid of my tower. I don't think I've ever seen him go after any other towers. I think he went after another tower like once and uh, that, that was uh, about it. And I think... Uh, I think that squid there going after Big B's stats tower and he doesn't seem very happy about it. And look at Lee there, look, going straight back for my tower again. It's not happening, Lee. It's not happening. Right, all I need to do then is keep Lee off my tower. Even though, he, like, this entire game he seemed to not have any armor or anything. He's just been so set on going after my tower. And look, there's someone here without any stuff. I can get a little double kill here. Saying that, I've managed to, to stay alive for a really long time now. My tower has been gradually getting destroyed, but I haven't been killed in ages. And remember, even if your tower is destroyed, that's not you immediately out. You've got to kind of be killed again. And there's Lee going for me again. I managed to, to knock him down. Oh, he fell down. While he's respawning, I got a chance to move up his tower a bunch here. Right, I managed to move up a little bit. My tower seems to be safe for now. I then need to press that one. I'm waiting to see Lee just jump down. Oh, no, he got an arrow on me. Right, okay, let's back off for a little bit. It's dangerous the, uh, the full damage can uh, hurt you quite a lot. Here's someone running around here. I think I've got some better armor than him. I should be able to take him out. I think he's just trying to guard or team up with me or something there. I'm not entirely sure. I don't think you're allowed to team up with each other. I don't even know how that would work. Oh, look, there's someone else there going for Lee's tower. I can kind of just leave them to it, I guess. Uh, someone there in full diamond armor. That's one of the uh, the people that help build the maps. You would kind of expect them to have a, a little bit uh, better loot than some of the commoners. And look at this guy going straight for my tower. I'm standing right here, mate. Oh, he's getting really close though. Right? I need to shoot them with some arrows. There we go. I managed to knock him off. Oh, did he do it though? I think he might have done it. Is my tower blown up? No, my tower's destroyed. He, man he managed to just about press the final button, which means now if I die, I am completely out of the game. And look, there's quite a few towers destroyed as well. I need to be super careful. And I look down here, look, there's a, there's, a, there's a diamond sword. I managed to get a diamond sword, which means I can actually go and take some people out now. I'm actually feeling a little bit more confident now, even though my tower is destroyed. If I go 1v1 up against someone, as long as they've not got too much diamond armor, I've got a pretty good chance of winning over here. I guess I just need to, to help destroy everyone else's towers. It's kind of nice not having to worry about defending my own tower, because uh, I kind of the whole time had to have like my head on a swivel making sure uh, that Lee wasn't going after my tower, but I don't need to do that. Right, I'm going to leave Big B stats. I'm actually going to guard Big B stats as he's taking out Lee's tower just to, just to get my revenge. So uh, yeah, while Big B stats is going up there, I'm going to keep an eye out for Lee and uh, try and make sure he's not able to take out Big B stats. Oh no, look, he's shooting him. Right, can I take out Lee from up here? Can I at least knock him off? That would be a, a really good thing to do, actually. I think my big competition is going to be this person over there. I think, yeah, that's Arbold with all of the, the diamond armor. If I try and get some, some good shots on him, I don't want him to chase after me, though. But if I'm able to get him weak, if I get him weak enough, I can then charge in with my, my diamond sword. I'm really squid. You want to mess with me? You really want to mess with me when I've got this sword? Actually, he's getting some, some good hits on me. Right? I'm going to actually uh, back up a little bit here. I think I was maybe feeling a bit too confident. But once I get my, my health up a little bit, I can just go and uh, charge him back down. I think it's not even just a normal enchanted sword. I think it's like a, uh, a normal diamond sword. I think it's an enchanted enchanted one as well, which makes it even stronger. There we go. Squid had no chance. I still had like full health after that fight there. <laughs> I think once I get rid of, um, 
uh, Arbold if I can. And if I get that diamond armor, so I got diamond armor and a diamond sword, then I am going to be absolutely set. <laughs> Big B Stats is there completely running for his life there, just trying to uh, get away from me if he can. Right, if I shoot Arbold as he's getting up to the top of the tower, then hopefully the, the full damage is going to really hurt him. And uh, then if I charge him with the diamond sword, all I need to do is get a few good hits and uh, then I can go and try and charge in and try and finish him off. I can hear arrows whizzing past my head from all sorts of different directions. Uh, I, think, I think Lee has decided just to camp on the top of his tower. I don't think he's decided to go down at all. It'd be good to, to knock him down. I think all he's trying to do is just stay at the top and just defend his tower, which I don't know if that is cheating. I don't I don't know if you are allowed to just stay up there. I, I guess you should be able to. Uh, I just need to get rid of that. The guy with the, the diamond armor because uh, like because I've got the diamond sword, I'm pretty much set. I just need to be really careful because I think he would just be about uh, able to, to beat me. Uh, I can see Big B stats here getting backed into a little corner. I should be able to, uh, to take him out relatively easy. He doesn't want to fight me he's not interested in it what I really need to do is shoot down he's just camping in his spawn he's just camping up there I'm guessing that's got to be allowed but I don't know it's kind of it's kind of a bit of a cheap tactic there Lee just camping up there so people can't get up I just need to be able to knock him off if I can if I just try and get one good arrow no someone's going after me oh ballistic squid he's got full iron armor as well can we get him get him get him get him get him there we go <laughs> wasn't gonna happen have I got full iron armor on yeah there we go I got full iron armor so I don't really need anything from him and here we go this is a good chance to get our bold while he's while he's not concentrating if I go up underneath him and get some good hits with this sword. I might actually be able to take him out here. I got some really good hits on him there. If I keep just keep whacking him, keep whacking him. Surely, why is he not dead yet? How is he not dying? Is it possible to kill him when he's got full diamond armor? I've been hitting him so much. There we go. I managed to I managed to take him out. And there's all diamond stuff all over the floor. Right, I got another diamond sword here, which is really going to help me out. I don't want to throw that on the floor. I need to get his diamond armor. Right, I just need to keep throwing stuff. There we go. I got a, a diamond chest plate on here. I think someone's there running down trying to get some more stuff. There we go. I got a diamond chest plate on and I think I got some some diamond boots as well. I'm feeling really kitted out now. I think I've got the uh, the best loot that's uh, left in the game. So let me go put this on as well. There we go. I got two diamond swords, a diamond chest plate and diamond boots. And there's another tower just got down. There's a blue tower just got taken out. Lee did it. Was that? Yeah, I think Lee's actually come down and joined in in the fight. Right, if I get this diamond helmet and uh, the, those spare diamond boots, then I am going to be absolutely set. Right, where's the helmet? Right, if I just go and throw down some of these rubbishy helmets. Oh, there's a, an enchanted bow there as well. Oh, and a splash potion of harming. I'm getting loads of great stuff here. But if I throw that down, or oh, another splash potion of harming. Uh, I'm going to keep that at hand so I can use that if I need it. And uh, where, where's the helmet? The helmet's right here. I should get it if I throw one more thing down. There we go. I got a diamond helmet as well. <laughs> I am so kitted out now. I've actually got a good chance of winning this. Is anyone left in? Have I won? Oh, look, there's someone over in the back corner over there. Right, what tower is let yet to be destroyed? Oh, there's one up here. There's a guy camping up in this, this tower up at the top here. I'm not sure who that is. If I knock them off, uh, then I might be able to get that tower. Is that the only tower left? Oh no, this tower here. Oh no, that's been blown up as well. Yeah, the only tower left is that one up there. So I need to destroy that tower and then kill everyone that's left in the game. So I think uh, Bigby Stats is uh, still in the game, uh, but his tower is destroyed. So if I kill him, uh, that should be him completely out. Oh no, no, that potion really, really hurt me there. That took me down to like half my health. That was that was pretty painful, I'll be honest. And now he's trying to he's trying to chase me down. I want to be careful here. I don't want to throw this away because remember, if I die one more time, uh, that is me then completely out. Alright, so let's go. Let's go after Big B Stats then. Let's try and let's try and get rid of him if we can. I want to be careful in case he's got another splash potion of harming. There we go. I managed to hit him with a splash potion of harming. And now all I need to do uh, is go and chase him down. I'm gonna go on the inside and uh, try and cut him off if I can. There we go, I got close to him. There we go, I got another two good hits. He's gonna be so weak. There we go. I think Big B Stats is now out of the game. Sorry, Big B Stats, but it is part of the game. And so where's my last competitor? Oh, there's someone up inside their tower, but the tower is destroyed. Maybe they're on their, their final spawn. And then there's someone right above me here. Right, I got my enchanted bow. I should be able to get some, some good hits in them. I don't think they've got any armor or anything up there. I don't want to try climbing up yet. Because uh, if I try climbing up now, then he might be able to knock me off. Right, let's go and try and get some good shots. Oh, that was a good shot on him there. I think I'm going to hurt him more because I've got this enchanted bow. But all I really want to do is knock him off. There we go. He was slain, but he is going to be able to respawn straight back there. So I want to, equi as quick as I can, start moving up this tower uh, before he goes and uh, charges down on me. So I want to do that one if I can. I know he's going to hit me off just any second. I can't hit the button. I can't hit the button. There we go. I managed to hit it. 
I think he's going to be now rushing to get all of his last few pieces of armor and stuff. And oh no, I did get knocked off and that hurt me a lot. Right, let's back off just in case he does go and try and charge in for the kill. No, I think he's going to do what Lee was doing and he's just going to camp up there. So I need to just get a few more good shots and I'll be able to take him out. Look at the rapid fire he's doing. Because I'm underneath him, he doesn't need to pull back the bow quite as uh, much uh, in order to hit me. And oh look, there's someone still running around here. Who's this still down? Is that Ballistic Squid? I think Ballistic Squid was still up in his tower. <laughs> well, we can if we try and team up to take up that guy, if I try, I'm going to try and protect Squid as he goes for that tower. And then, yeah, then that way it will only be down to a, a 1v1 because that guy up there, I'm not sure who it is. I think is that Arbold? Uh, let me have a quick look who that is. Oh, no, that's Reaper Zero. Uh, because Reaper Zero still got his tower, he's kind of in the lead because he's, he's if he dies, he's still allowed to, uh, to carry on playing. And uh, Squid's going to be definitely uh, going for me. Let me try and let me try and say to, to team up with Squid if I can, and then we can go and try and take up this person. And then it will be uh, down to down to just us. I don't think Squid really knows what he's doing. I think he just wants to try and pick up as much loot as he can. Or let me just try and say team up, team up, team up, team up. No, is he is he saying yes? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let me... Uh, I'm not going to throw him anything. I just want to say friends now. Okay, so we're now both going to team up, hopefully, uh, if he doesn't betray me, and uh, try and take out this this other person over here. I'm going to watch my back, though, because we are still against each other, uh, but at the moment, we kind of got uh, a common interest in wanting to uh, to be uh, to take out this tower. And, oh, look, the guy's come down. The guy's gone down over there, and Squid's going up behind him. Right, I think I think Squid's going to be able to take him out, and while Squid's doing that, I, I can move up here and start uh, trying to take out this tower. There's a good chance Squid is going to betray me, though, and he's going to attack me from behind. I gotta, I gotta kind of uh, expect that. I'm gonna keep a, an eye behind me. And I'm getting it so close here. Oh no, he managed to knock me off though. He did manage to knock me off. I'll be able to kill him though. Then I'll be able to go straight back up and uh, carry on doing it again. Okay, Squid, you wanna go up and do the tower? Yeah, team up, Squid, team up. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna go. I'm just scared he's gonna kill me as, I, as I'm on my way up. This guy's gonna charge down and try and knock me off again. And he's probably gonna succeed, to be honest. But I'm still just making slow and gradual progress. I think Squid killed him. Yeah, Squid, Squid managed to, to take him out. I can keep moving this up here. And then it's just gonna be me and Squid down in a 1v1 at the end. Oh no, he's managed to knock me off again. He's just being completely desperate now, just trying to take me out. <laughs> there we go. Just a, another little check with Squid that we're teaming up. We can't trust each other. There is only going to be one winner in the end. Me and Squid are going to have to have a battle against each other, but we really need to take out this person's tower because he could do some damage against us. At the moment, he's just being completely desperate, charging down. But if he managed to get some good loot and he managed to keep his spawn... Oh no, he fell off. He just dived straight off. And I think, I, I think I've almost done it. I think one more button press. I've done it. I managed to, I managed to blow up his tower. Right, okay, now I'm saying let's fight, yeah? Let's fight, Squid, okay? Battle time. Uh, okay, well, is he like Oh, no, he's still up there. Oh, he's, he's off. He's full off. He's dead. It's just down to me and Squid. It's a 1v1. We need to go up against each other now. We need we need to go and fight. Nope, no, nope, we need to fight. We need to fight. There can only be one winner in the end. Oh, and he got a good splash potion on me there. That really hurt me. If he's got, he's got like two more splash potions, he could actually kill me. That is going to be my downfall. I don't think the... Uh, I don't think this really uh, helps against them. I don't think the diamond armor helps against potions as much uh, as it does like bows and arrows and swords and stuff. Right, I knew he was going to charge around the other way. I knew he was going to do it. I know he's getting good hits on me. He's actually really hurting me here. I need to go in. I need to get him. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, no, no I'm getting really hurt. I'm getting really hurt. No, he got me. <laughs> he managed to take me out. I was so sure I was going to win. <laughs> well done, Ballistic Squid. What a game. <laughs> uh, I think he had like an enchanted armor or something, which was uh, really able to help him out. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this game. Uh, big congratulations uh, to Ballistic Squid for um, yeah for, for winning the uh, what is probably the first ever game uh, of the Towers PvP map. Uh, in the description, there's going to be a link to everyone else's channels. Uh, for everyone else that was uh, playing in this game, uh, if you want to check out the uh, the game from their perspective. Uh, also, if you want to download the map, uh, there'll also be a link in the description to the download so you can download it and play it for yourselves. But that's the end of this video here. I want to thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you later. Bye!